a good evening everyone welcome back oh well not really welcome back welcome to Dark Souls 2 Scholar of the First Sin now wow okay we need to fix the volume holy crap okie dokie hold on give me a moment oh shit this is really Wait, there's no volume slider? <laughs> there's no volume slider. Okay, we're gonna fix it. Okay, hold on, hold on. This is very loud, I am very sorry about this. Let's say about 7, okay? We are 28. I think my headset is a little louder than it needs to be. Let's go down to 24. Yeah, that seems. Okay. Okay, and Dark Souls 6. Sure, seems fine for now. You guys will probably let me know. A Um, if it's too much. Okay then. So, my goodness. I try to do so many different things. Look at that, the only thing that actually worked for this is the offline mode. It's insane. I tried so many different mods. You... You have no idea. Oh man. Now I guess I can turn everything back on because they were off for for the EMB, which doesn't really work. There we go. That's on. That's high. That's high. Hi. Uh, motion blur though? No, thank you. Not a big fan of the motion blur. Okay then, I think with this we pretty much... We're pretty much set to go. So I made a little stupid character just to... There we go, remove it. It was a testing character. I, I tested the EMBs, I tested all the mods, and nothing was working. So my idea was to make this, well, first thing to make it look better. And by that I mean using an EMB, replacing some textures, some sky boxes, and it was nice. It was a nice idea. There are some very cool mods on uh, the Dark Souls to Nexus page. The problem is most of them don't work with the Scholar of the First Sin edition. The thing is, the original Dark Souls 2 was was game developed with DirectX 9 in mind. And everything that came out, all the mods, all the Gitto, Sato, you know, the modding tool for Durante, Everything was supposed to work only for DirectX 9. When they made this, which was kind of a remaster, I believe, almost at least, they updated the graphics, they updated, they included all the DLCs, but I think the biggest change was that they uh, they developed the game for di with DirectX 11 because of the new graphic options I guess and that broke pretty much every single modding tool available now there are some that are supposed to work it's an injection tool called IGP 11 that is used with Dark Souls 3 I downloaded it you can make it work with Dark Souls 2 I it was detecting Dark Souls 2 it was launching Dark Souls 2 
but for some reason it wasn't applying the EMVs and it wasn't injecting the texture, it wasn't replacing any texture whatsoever. So I guess we're gonna do without that. Alright, let me turn off the lights and let's make a new character in a new game. Perhaps you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. A murky, forgotten land. I love this intro, by the way. Souls may mend your ailing mind. You will lose everything once branded. The symbol of the curse. An augur of dark. Your past, your future, your very light. None will have meaning and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. to a flame. Your wings will burn in anguish. Time after time. For that is your fate. The fate of the cursed. Off we go! <laughs> Hello, Hexe! Yes, Dark Souls intros are amazing. Oh boy! How are you doing, Hexe? Get ready for overly loud grass rustling. <laughs> I mean, I love the volume quite a lot, so I hope. It's gonna be, um, it's gonna be fine.
Man, look at that. That looks really good. The things betwixt. There we go. Here I am. A little dude with no face for now. Isn't it weird when you walk really slowly? It almost looks like you. Uh, you're walking in slow mo. <laughs> ah, there we go. Yes. How could I forget about the rustling? Man, look at this. Uh, so, this time around, we're not gonna have a dead counter. I mean, I already finished the game, so. Feels like I don't need to shame myself more than I'm gonna do anyway by playing the game, so. There's that. This looks great, by the way. It's a fantastic intro zone. Well, at least, at least this very specific room, I guess. I got everything I need. I um, I know what to play. I know. I kinda know how to build a character. Kinda. So we'll see what happens. Oh, you know what? I never managed to punch one of those things. They always slip away. The little bastards. There they are. Look at them. Quick. I just can't. <gasps> I punched one. Oh my god, I punched one. Oh god, no, maybe that was a bad idea. Oh, that was a really bad idea. That's why I never punched one. That's why I never punched one before. God. Don't worry, it's fine. They're not gonna follow me over here, right? Oh boy. <laughs> That's a very good start, isn't it? <laughs> We are, um, we're hot. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm already almost dead. I mean, I didn't even get to the, I didn't even get to the character creation screen. <laughs> God's sake. Uh, oh, my God. Speaking of. Wasn't there a giant over here? And some loot as well. Yeah. Yeah, right. Um, I don't think I can sneak past, maybe? Oh, yeah, there's something behind him. Yeah, right. Yeah, like, that's gonna happen. I mean, I will probably try to make it happen. Oh, wait a second. The jumping is different. Oh, it's this. Oh my god, it's even worse probably than Dark Souls. Because to jump, I have to press down the movement stick. I mean, it was already awkward enough in Dark Souls where you have to press the running button. So you have to release the run and then press it. This time it's even worse. It's the movement button. <laughs> can I... Can not just... Can they not just... I don't know. Like that. Or one. Uh, L1. Or two. I don't know. Anything, really. Seems to be the ruckus. Oh my, your face. The rude. Face of the curse. Very rude. Have you seen yourself? It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear. Didn't you? <laughs> Who did I speak to? Oh, the old lady up, up above? You Probably. Go hollow. Oh, you'll go hollow. Yes. You'll become one of them. Hollows prey upon them. 
what I want. Feast upon their souls. This but I may is the fate of the curse. I may accidentally <laughs> kill one or two NPCs. I mean that happened to everybody, right? Just something that you cannot avoid really. What is your name? What is my name? Well, I'm glad you asked. My name is uh Kure. Yes. Can I? Can I? There we go. Yes. Okay. Yes, I, I'm sure that's my name. Yeah. At least you know your own name. They are very quiet, and the music is very loud. Oh my! Is it though? That looks. Who do you think it's supposed to be? You can be whatever you want to be. Deep into your past. Yes, it's an effigy of you. Oh my! Do I look like that? Yikes! Ah, here we are. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, so what we're gonna need here is mostly dexterity and faith, I believe. Now, I see many, many different stats over there. How do I know which is which? So the face is what? I don't know. I guess in the heart is vitality. The legs is what is the legs? <laughs> Star one for hell? No. It's select. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's my level. Viger, which is HP, of course. Endurance. Okay, that's vi. Oh, that's vital. That's equipment load. Okay. Then we have the useless attunement. So we need these three. Uh, it's even worse, Hexa, because I have a PlayStation 3 controller and it's giving me Xbox controls. Ah, uh, this game. Strength, okay. 15 is too much. We need a maximum of 13. Uh, Dexter is the one we need. That is adaptability, which is another one of those we need. Which is, I think it's faster casting. Faster rolling, more invincibility frames, and resistances. Then dexterity and faith is the last one. Okay, so we need. Wow, that is 16 dex and. No oh, wow, that is very dexterous. The swordsman. Maybe a little too much. This. Wow, look at that dude. Holy... <laughs> oh my... <laughs> Although, stat-wise, it looks... Oh, it's actually worse than the Swordman. It's gonna be more vitality, it's gonna be more... Um, uh, load, equipment load, but... It's a Fallout 3 Raider. That is actually very accurate. <laughs> it looks like it. It's a helmet that does it, isn't it? A cleric would have been a good choice. Uh, the problem is... Absolutely no adaptability and no dexterity. The Explorer is... Yikes. I'm oh, hmm. you know what? I might go for the pride. Although, although I think the explorer, it's it's okay as well.
increases my endurance a little, my equip load and uh, attunement. Uh, well, it's only one point attunement. The thing is, probably as soon as I get the item for a full respec, I'm gonna go back to the witches anyway and remove everything except what I actually need. It's a bit of a shame. Because I'm not going to do any damage. I have very low dexterity. It's got a dagger, for God's sake. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to go with the sword, man. At least see, this guy has a lot of dexterity. Not a lot of HP. But it should be fine, right? Should be fine. Gift. Um, bonfire ascetic for sure. There aren't many around, so it's always good to have some of those. Gender, male, build. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try and use it at some point. I guess we're gonna go... Oh, do we want to be ripped or do we want to be normal? Let's just be normal. <laughs> Not sure how long am I gonna spend naked in this game, but still. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my goodness, these people are... Holy sh... What happened to this guy? <laughs> we have baby face here, we have Mr. Baby face. And then this guy's very happy, but also he's quite orange. Red, well, this guy's orange, this guy's red. I don't even... <laughs> sure... Oh my god... <laughs> what am I even doing? Can we do something to his face, please? Hormones? Yeah, give him a boost of hormones. <laughs> I don't think that's how it works. Uh, age. Make it older. Maybe that'll help. Oh my god, I don't think it's gonna help. Can I randomize his face or something? Random. Uh... <laughs> wow. Oh my god. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, how do I fix this, guy? How do I fix it? I don't... You know what? Can we random his face instead? Holy sh... <laughs> I don't think this can be fixed. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god, it's getting worse! It's getting much, much worse! No oh, shit! What am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? How fucked up can he get? If I keep randomizing... It's, it's becoming... Oh my lord, what the f- it looks like one of those um, Japanese Tengu masks. 
can I give it a skin tone that I can actually see? Um, I'm not sure this can be f oh my god what happened to this guy now <laughs> it became a ghost it died and became a ghost <laughs> holy shit this is an alien this is oh <laughs> it's turning into the moon <laughs> Oh my god, yeah, this is perfect. Oh my! <laughs> some, some lipstick? <sighs> oh my, <laughs> he's so sad now. <laughs> he's a sad ghost. Oh. Okay, the eyes are going chameleon style, they're sliding on the side more and more. His chin is freaking longer than his nose. Holy crap. Yeah, no, this is perfect. Is this gonna be our guy? You know what, can, can we... Tattoos are so <laughs> fucked up because of his face. <laughs> I guess no tattoo. No tattoo for you. Um, I think though that we're gonna give you a <laughs> nice little. Nice. <laughs> How about that? How about a nice little mustache? <laughs> To give him uh, uh, yellow eyes. <laughs> Red eyes. <laughs> Completely black eyes. Oh, I don't know. I think yellow is kind of the creepiest. Oh my god. Obviously, we're gonna also go for um, let's, let's try at least some consistency in his. Uh, oh my! <laughs> okay, I like the one that we're arcing over his face. Perfect, yeah, this. <laughs> oh my, I don't even. Holy crap, what am I. Is this Michael Jackson now? <laughs> Is it too soon? No, it's not, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Um Yeah, sure. Let's go. Let's go with the Michael Jackson. <gasps> no. Oh, thank goodness. I thought I lost it for a moment. Yeah, no, that's perfect. That is absolutely perfect. What can we do to make it even better. I don't think we can do anything else here. <gasps> Wait, we can move the tattoo. Oh, okay, we're gonna give him a nice tattoo then. We're gonna give him a black hole, black ball. Yeah, that sounds about right. What is it? A 
to we're gonna position it yeah um, seems like it's in the middle mostly <laughs> do, we, do we tattoo his chin or his forehead actually I kind of feel like I should almost tattoo one of his eyes <laughs> Can I give you the second one? I need both eyes like this. Oh, I can have only one? Dang it. But what if? But what if? <laughs> what if we do this? Oh my, it, now it looks a bit scary. Oh my god, this is perfect. It's the Triskelion. Perfect. Perfect. Triskelion. It's a very, um, it's a very important, oh my god, what did I make? It's a very important, I, I kind of want to not call it Q right now. Uh, <laughs> sure, finalized creation. That's, that's amazing. All people come here for the same reason. To break the curse. You are no different, I should think. Hmm, doesn't stand a chance. Well, you never know. <laughs> Go through the door and trot along to the kingdom. But remember, Hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going hollow. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. Oh yeah, I know. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah, you know... Most of the times I laugh about it too, so I understand, old ladies. <laughs> it's brighter than a torch. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> this is... This is nightmarish. What have I done here? Hi guys, this is me. Holy crap. <laughs> okay, perfect. Absolutely perfect. So, uh, we can talk with the ladies. Let's see what they have to say. You must go on a journey without rest. Yes. Well, I suppose if you find yourself at an arm pass. Arm pass? Will is yet unbroken. Then you may return here. Okay. To Gonna give me directions? With a clean slate. Oh. <laughs> oh, I see. I think they're hinting at the respect. Uh, can we fix the audio, though? Oh. Okay. 
Okay, let's try like this. Music down, voices up. This is a limbo. A link between Drangleic and the outer world. Fair traveler, I know that you must have a story. Why else would you visit such a place? Do you really have did it? This lost, decayed kingdom. Well, if I push it even the more, and then I tune back up uh, the actual audio source. Is this gonna be okay? My name is Millibeth. Yes. The old women were once fire keepers. I am here to look after them. It is what my mother did, and her mother before her, and so on. Right. Uh, I have a feeling that the sound effects are gonna be a little loud. So let's just try them out. Not even that much. I mean, uh, the, the thing there is a little loud, but I think it's supposed to be loud. It's a freaking waterfall, of course it's gonna be loud. Yeah, 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 I remember about the chest. I think there is something I want to do first. Ah, here we go. Blam. By the bonfire, we don't have an Estus yet. Which is a bit of a shame. Oh, good old rolling. Oh my god. How do we find out if it's a Mimic again? It's a different color in this game. It's a human effigy. I think the human effigies are what you need to turn back your uh, into a human. Oh my lord. Every time I look at what I made right now, it's just worse every time. And there's an item over here as well. Yes. Ah, yes, the torches. I remember. Uh, there is a way to do something called power stancing. I don't exactly remember. That is clearly not power stancing. This is a parry, I think. This is an attack, this is an attack. Maybe I cannot power stance two weapons. I have no clue. Anyway, let's keep talking to these people. <laughs> well, she's laughing. Two-handing? Uh, I was two-handing. That was a two-hand. The one with a parry. Now, go along. Go along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about you? <laughs> You're laughing too. What about you? The old women were keepers of the fire. But now, the fire shows signs of fading. And the kingdom is beset by hollows. <laughs> Did you see that I am actually moving her... Um, the cloth she's got in her head? <laughs> the parry. Whoa! <laughs> the old women are sisters. Yes. I am told there was a fourth. Yes, she's um long she's ago. Up fire keepers away. were commonplace. But now they are lost, scattered to the winds. The old women assist Yeah, okay, thank you. Right, uh let's learn how to play Dr. Sue all over again, shall we? And what better way to do it? then fight an impossibly hard giant at the very beginning of the game and probably die a couple of times in doing so
I mean, he's pretty chill. He's not chill anymore. Ooh, ow. Holy sh Oh my god, I have no frames while rolling. Holy... I thought I was invincible while rolling. Clearly not. I guess I cannot parry that guy as well. But hey, at least I have no soul to lose, right? No souls. Or no humanity for now. Two-handing is the way, but you need a correct. Yeah, I remember something about the kind of weapon you're holding. I guess that must be it then. I'm holding two weapons that cannot be power stanced. Wait, what's what's here? Retrieval. A grand total of zero. Fuck me. All right, buddy. Woo. Come on. Come on, roll. <gasps> Yo. Okay, yeah, he got me there. What the hell? He's got an insane reach, doesn't he? He looks slow, he looks like he's not gonna hit you, but he's gonna punch you. And let me tell you, he doesn't need a lot of punches to knock you out. Oh boy. Okay, my maximum HP is going down. Now I remember how dying works in this game. Oh, goodness me. Yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, I might not want to do this now then. Or maybe I can distract it. Excuse me, can I just... Whoa! Okay, you know what? Stay there. Uh, over here. I just wanted to steal your stuff! Oh, wait, you still turn... Take it, please! Oh, oh. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's bad. I got something, though. I'm not sure what it was, but I got something. So screw that guy, I'm out of here. What did I get? Uh. Pine resin, maybe? Or a swallowing. Yeah, okay. 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 Now, there is another weird mechanic in this game, and it's the torches. I still... I remember some very, very dark places. What was the place to rest? Oh, yeah, okay. Yes, like this. And sometimes you need to light stuff up. I seem to remember there is some sort of use for lighting stuff up. And that's a stone people. Yeah, you need uh what were they called? Fragrant branch of yours? Your, yours? I don't know. It's a knight that you need to de-stone them. Yori or Yori, whatever.
Scimitar is a v holy sh shit, dude! What happened? <laughs> I guess I died. I lost my tattoos. I don't want to say it's better or worse. I have no idea. Apparently, also torches have a. Five minute duration, which is okay, I guess. There we go, I got a dagger. <clears throat> Dude with a crossbow. Uh, there's more dudes, I think. Yo! Why didn't it attack twice? Sick of the manly chin. Yes. yes. <laughs> Not even death can get rid of that chin. And those beautiful, beautiful eyes. Okay, that was a hint for something. I. It's gone now. Whoa! That was a move. Items are really hard to see in this one. My goodness. Okay, we got it. We only have one minute and a half on my torch, so we better move it. Two hand weapon, I cannot, unfortunately. Okay, now this is gonna be. This is gonna be it. Holy crap. I love that if you fuck up, you're just gonna spaz out and in order to try and push down your movement stick, you're, you're probably gonna jump somewhere else. Turn to the last second. Can I do a jump attack here? On this guy? Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Don't worry. I got it. I got it. Kinda. 25 seconds on my torch. I think it's pretty much gone now. And I don't think I have another one. And that's it. Oh no, this. Oh well, that is. Wait, can I. No, statue blocks my way, we can't get in there. Torch is gone, but I think we are. No, seriously? I missed the last one? <laughs> Look at <laughs> He's really sad and by Look at him. Oh, I missed one. Oh. <laughs> Oh my, what a, what a face. Oh. <laughs> he looks really sad. Oh, oh my, uh, there's a pe I am missing actually a piece of my chin, I think. Just a tip.
just the tip of my chin, but it is broken. And here we are to good old Majula. Okay, so I don't remember if there's items over there. I know that's the way to somewhere where we cannot go yet. Grave you ahead indeed. Oh no. Ah, oh, flashbacks. Look at these motherfuckers. God damn you. You're gonna be the death of me. Quite literally. Multiple times. That might be the right way to go. Let's rest to the bonfire. Oh, nice. Look, we can travel now. Oh, great. Burn stuff. Yeah, I remember the binocular. I don't know where it is. Ah, huh, well, we'll see. I think it was somewhere. It might be that thing. I can see it in the distance over there. We'll see. Hey there, lady. Are you the next monarch? I don't know. Am I? Or merely a pawn of fate? You tell me. Bearer of the curse. I will remain by your side till this frail hope shatters. <laughs> I mean. Take this with you. I don't blame you. Look at him. your journey. <laughs> Go on and see the king. He who made Drangleg what it once was. He who peered at the essence of the soul. King Vendrick. Oh, I remember Vendrick. You may level up by the power of the Emerald Herald, which is this. Damn, yo. Is this, is this, God damn it. There we go. <coughs> is this island? Because I need to be there. Bearer of the curse. Yes. For misery will lead you to greater, stronger souls. Well, I'm sure we'll find a you lot of misery. You will never meet the king with a soul so frail and pallid. <laughs> I think you got the pallid <laughs> part right. Um. <laughs> And there's the classic dude over here, the poor crestfallen warrior, sits in every single Dark Souls. But first, great view ahead. Holy crap, this is, ouch, this is really nice, really, really nice. You're undead, aren't you? Yes. You have that distinct scent, the smell of irreversible fate. I'm sorry, that's, you know, I'm, I've been dead for a while. It is a kind of settlement, a place where life is almost normal. Right, almost. And in Drang Lake these days, there are very few places like that. I am Solden. Solden. And like you, I lost everything. And now I'm here. Dude, it's fine. Cheer up. You're in a beautiful place. That it was possible to break the curse here. Well, that's not true at all. There's nothing here for you, me, or anybody. It does have a really bad rep, and to me, I mean, I played it only once, that's that's true, but it's totally unjustified for me. Yes, some bosses are a bit bullshit, 
I I know that, but man, look at this. Look at that. Look at this. <laughs> I mean, look at this. Do you know much about souls? Even I'm not certain, but... I'm told that the soul is the essence of life itself. Anything living, sentient or no, supposedly has one. What we call the curse is traceable to the soul. Do you see what that means? Mm, maybe. To be alive. To walk this earth. That's the real curse. Right there. Dude. We undead will never die. And that's quite a predicament, really. The fate of the undead is really horrible, by the way. Just dying over and over and over until you lose parts of you and then you slowly go insane. Damn, it's really bad, isn't it? There are four beings in this land with giant souls. And wherever you go from here, you'll sooner or later come up against them. Each has a powerful soul and a terrible curse. If that frightens you, then you ought to just give up right now. Like I have. <laughs> Damn. Do you ever cry out for help? Oh my god. The journey of an undead is long and treacherous. You'll face invaders from other worlds at every No, I won't. I mean, offline if mode. you need help, why not proclaim faith in the Blue Sentinels? When you face danger, the Blue Sentinels will come to your aid. I mean, the... Action is yours. I will probably get some, um, Red Phantoms, though. You need only accept their kind embrace. Sure. Don't need it, but you know what? Sure. That is a wise decision. People are weak, but the blue sentinels watch over us in their benevolence. Let the sentinels cradle you in their embrace. That's probably blank, isn't it? To death worldwide. Yeah, it's uh, it's gonna be my death counter. Do you feel lonely here? It suits me just fine, as I have nothing left anyway. Dude, you need therapy. Seriously. It will go on you, this place. Give it some time. Ah, here we go. No gesture. There we go. Done. May you find peace on your Alright, so... I think what we need to do... In this game is find those four giant souls. And present them at... Uh, the castle to get access to Grand Lake. That is the first part of the game, I believe. So the four souls... If let's see if I can remember them. Um, let's see. I think the rotten down in the statue area is one of them. Uh, oof, who else? The lost sinner. It's that guy chained in that dark, dark room, very fast with the sword. It's on the bottom of the undead area prison yeah uh, what else there is oh the spider lady Dukes Freya 
Duke dearest Freya, something like that. In uh, Bright Brightstone Cove, Taldora. Yes, that's another one. And who was the fourth one? Uh, let's see. Oh, the the Iron King, right? The old Iron King. All right, yeah. Hello. Who are you? Uh, just a dude. No, oh, it doesn't matter. Just help me open this door. Okay. I packed my tools in here, seeing it was vacant. But now somebody's gone and locked the door. <laughs> the boss was a pain. You know, I didn't even struggle against that boss. I was a mage. A sorcerer in my previous play. And I managed to just stay away. Dodge a bunch of things and... Kill it in a few soul arrows. So it was fine. Uh, I did experience, however, the real boss of that place, which is the hole in the middle of the room. <laughs> that thing killed me more than the boss itself. Bone, and this is the weird covenant that doubles. This is the one that doubles the difficulty. I don't know why would I ever. What the hell was that? The whole yes, yes, that was, that was it. Okay, so there's this house, which is the merchant. Yes, I remember. And the more money you spend on this guy, the more stuff he's gonna have for you, which is a bit weird because he doesn't really have anything useful. But maybe some cosmetic armor set, who knows? Uh, oh. oh hello there. Uh, 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 hi. W welcome to my uh, shop. Uh, okay. I'm Morlin. Uh, are you uh, sure? Well, you don't seem very so sure I... about it. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. What is up with you, man? I could really use the business. If you'd be so kind. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get over my character. I came from the west, from Volgan. Volgan? Have you been there? No. It's a lively place, vibrant with trade. I don't believe you. Very competitive, of course. And you have to grease the wheels to get anywhere. But I didn't have the funding for that, so I left home in hopes of striking gold. Everything is dead it's been everywhere. Years since then, and I've. <laughs> Well, I've made very little headway. <laughs> I mean, you have your own shop. I don't even know why I'm still here. I don't know, you tell me. Everything's all run down and dying. It was t terrible for business, really. A group calling themselves the Blue Sentinels have gained much power in Volgan. Oh. You can't even run a shop without their blessing. Ooh. They claim to be working for the greater good, but oh, there's absolute hogwash. There's a little extra... Um... Some some shade over the blue sentinels. They seem all nice and you know jolly cooperation and all that, but <sighs> guess they're not that good, huh? Oh, by the gods, why the hell am I here? It's got a couple of shields, yeah, and uh, oh, the falconer almost said actually. I remember being quite. Alright, the beginning of the game. 
But this again is... Well, I, I, well, I do hope I see you again. Is definitely fashion soul, so... Doesn't really matter too much. Now, I remember the three, the three little assholes behind this house. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go for the, for the rapiers. There are three different rapiers that I kind of want to use. Two of them we can get... Uh, well, one we can buy from the blacksmith. One is a reward in... Ah, uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, it's a reward in Drangling for killing one of the old giants. And the last one is a drop from an enemy in one of the DLC areas. So it's gonna be a little bit of a mess to find all of them. By the way, is this a, the fastest roll there is? Where's my weight? 28% Seems like there's no difference so fast does that mean I can use my other oh this is much cooler although I do have to show my beautiful face this is way stronger though and I can still fast roll all right I'll, I'm gonna keep that then Uh, I forgot how to open this. There was a key so somewhere, yeah, but I don't remember where. Or was it a secret wall or something? The rolling is a bit different, obviously, yeah. It seems like you don't get many invincibility frame for starters. Ah, what's it? What time it is? I think it's already time. Isn't it? Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll be right back, guys. I got something to drink. I'm gonna go for a quick pee and I'm gonna leave it. Alright.
and here I am. Wow, the wind is very loud, isn't it? Probably should um, lower the effect volume a little. Uh, okay. Man, I can't believe I can drink water out of the fridge and it's kinda fresh. That wasn't... that didn't happen in a long time. I mean. <laughs> Oh, this is just. Yeah, this might be a good, uh, a good compromise. Okay, so let's get in there. Uh, yeah, about the rolling, it is definitely different. Uh, the recover time from the rolling it seems to be a lot higher. Like, look at the final frame. It looks like ah, oh, it's bending the knee and then moving. Look at this. Ooh. So it definitely is lower. Uh, I think it also has. Oh shit. I think it also has lower um, invincibility frame. But it can get better with the adaptability skill attribute or whatever you want to call it. Hey, Shokwa. Wasn't there a chest in here? Huh. Weird. Hey, Shalky. Oh, I'm dead, are we? I like this guy. Old One lady. without much time remaining. Just about ready to fall apart, I'd say. Not exactly the time to be chatting with a cat. <laughs> well, suit yourself. Oh, yes. You may call me Shalkwa. Shakwa. Enchante. Oh, enchante to you. So, what did you want anyway? Ooh, you smell wonderful. Excuse me? <laughs> I mean, yeah, oh, you had to kind of oh, buy me a coffee before you can say things like that. Remember, she has the ring you need to drop down the hole. Yes, reduce damage from falling. The silver cat ring. Red eye ring. Uh, easier to be detected by enemy. Weird. Name engraved ring. Easier to connect a player. The ring of whisper. Can hear the voices of foes. That was a very weird ring. Ring worn by Roy, the explorer. Hear the inner voices of surrounding foes. Useful for locating hidden enemies and perhaps for a few other things as well. Secret ring. And absorb HP from fallen foes. Gotcha. Also, pommel bones, treasons, talismans, and whatnot. Okay. This place is already dead. Yeah. Everything will crumble and waste away so that something new may be born. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> this place is fascinating. We receive only the most peculiar visitors. Folk like yourself. Very peculiar. It's enough to keep even a cat amused. <laughs> Are you going to see the old ones? Um, excuse me? The Those old ones? Who have grown so incredibly ancient. You mean Cthulhu and his brothers? They must have sprouted quite a thick coat of moss by now. For heaven's sake. Oh shit, no one right. No even knows their names anymore. Sorry about that. Forgot. Imagine that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Nothing like yourself. We no. We do have a most pleasant scent. It grows nicer with each passing day. <laughs> you know, it's, um... It needs some... You know what? Sure. Have you made friends with the man by the sea? Oh, you mean the depressed dude? He's lost everything. Absolutely everything. <laughs> yeah, he needs he help. The only thing he's looking for now is a few tidbits on covenants. 
covenants are a type of, well, contract, you might say. Aha. Uh -huh. You give something to gain something. That's the way humans like it, right? I guess so. It might be just the thing you need. But what does a cat know? Meow. <laughs> 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 Did you see that oddly formed rock behind here? Uh, which Long one? Long ago they called it oh, a yeah. stone, as I recall. If you wish to face greater challenges, speak to the rock. Although, you'd just as well not. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> this place is... Alright, thank you, Shokwa. I Nothing will see suitable. you around. Well, that's dismaying. Bam. That's the shard. Okay, where are the three little fuckers? Oh my god, I hate these things. Oh, oh. <laughs> Already I almost died by falling into the giant hole in the middle of Majula. God damn. Oh my god. Oh, I can't hit them. Nice. I need... Oh, shit. Classic Q, right? Classic Q. Yeah, that works. Ow, bitch. Okay, one down. Oh, what the hell? A little... Can you get the hell d- Ah, uh, yes. Oh, the keep- They keep giving me this little nudge that really hurts. And I can barely hit them. At all. There we go. Three fucking little piggies. For nothing, right? That, that was a completely dead end. Yeah, I, I remember. So where the hell... Was... The key? This... Wait. This guy had a key? No. Well, I... Shut up. I don't care about you. Was it down here? Oh, this was a weird contraption. You needed that holy lady. She... Well, you pay her or him. I don't remember if it's a lady or it's a guy. You pay him and she shifts. This entire room and the opening goes on the other side. And you can get to the other side and yada yada yada. Just this was going somewhere and there was loot. Also, can I equip my Estus? Wait, I have only one Estus. One. Crimson Parma, which is a shield, unfortunately. And yeah, you need to open this from the other side, I believe. Oh wait, no, there was a thing over here. Ah, yes. Okay, where is this going again? Soul of the Lost Undead, a broken thief sword. Alright. 
Where the hell am I going? Oh! Hide a tower? Oh, man. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, you scared the shit out of me! <laughs> this is the guy that is just sitting there, but if I attack him, it's not good stuff. Wait a second, is this guy different? Did my texture injection actually work? Or is it the same? I don't remember. I thought this was orange. I kind of have a feeling that this was completely orange, but I might be mistaken. Yeah, but this area is um, way too much for me right now. Let's go back. Uh, hello? Oh, sorry. My controller died and then it came back to life, I guess. No worries, it happens, and it will happen, probably during some boss fight or something, I oh, don't know. Wait, how did that happen? Oh, it's a, it's a time thing? I see, I see. I thought it would stay open, but apparently it doesn't. Or does it now? How the hell would I know? No, I heard it. It probably closed. Man, look at my stamina. I can barely run for two seconds and boom, it's over. Not good. We'll need to fix stamina and HP as soon as possible. The problem is remembering where everything is. Like, I don't remember how to get the key for the blacksmith. I don't remember how to get the key for the place, the estate. I guess I'm just gonna go and talk to you. You go? Yago? Yogurt? The dude with the blue sword. The fake moonlight blade. Yes, that's him. Hey there. Have you business with me? The way you're under is all blocked up, you see. Paris. <laughs> God off his statue. Heavens above. Who thought it a good idea to pit it there? Oh no. It's so another Scottish. Is it? See that statue? Gives me the willies. You stare at it for long enough. Oh, is that Irish? It to look alive. Ach, it just doesn't seem quite No, right. it's definitely Scottish. There are no craftsmen around these parts. Ah. Uh. Hey, you don't think a real life person was turned to stone, do you? See that statue? Gives me the willies. It's made out well. It's it for long enough. It starts to look alive. Ah, it just doesn't seem quite right. There are no craftsmen around these parts. God damn, it's so awesome. Hey, you don't think a real life person. I think I need to live there for a couple of years. Uh. 
pick up the accent. So then I can actually use it and not seem racist. <laughs> I can justify it by... You know, I live there, so that's my accent. I need torches, don't I? And uh, there was... Ah, I think there is a way to fall onto that. You can absorb it when you hear it enough. Yeah, I always um, had this saying that when I interact with somebody that is from somewhere with a different accent, even if it's still Italian, I, for some reason I do pick up that kind of accent. If I speak for too long with somebody, I just, I don't know. It's like my brain picks up the mannerisms and uh, the little inclinations of the words. And uh, yeah, it just happens naturally, I guess. Seek those whose names their soul once you have said right, that. If I have. Is that a show? To yeah. Light. Yeah, 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 upgrade my flask. Yes. Thank you very much. I had only one. But now I have a grand total of two users of the Estus flask. Isn't that insane? Two. God, even the first Dark Souls gave, gave you to begin with, right? Oh, and yes, you consume your sword very quickly by smashing at the walls. So I think at some point I'm gonna read up where all the invisible walls are to avoid breaking my weapons. Yes, um, pretty much the big problem was all the mods were made for Doctor 2. Doctor 2 works with DirectX 9. And uh, all the mods and all the programs like the uh, Durante DS Fix, you know, the original DS Fix, they all worked well with that version. But then, Skull of the First Sin is actually made with direct eggs oh, I could roll there it's made for direct X 11 so nothing really works every single mold I've installed it didn't work yet with the only exception being the one that kills my online mode. I think not even the durability fix worked. Oh, this guy's here. Uh, what now? Can I get behind him? Oh shh! Yeah. Scared as shit. I forgot completely about this. <laughs> Already ambushed in the four, first corner of the game. <laughs> wow. Wow. 
Not gonna say anything but wow. Are you gonna be problem? Are you gonna be trouble? Doesn't look like it's gonna be trouble. Do I want to make it trouble? I don't think so. No, you know what? Screw that guy. Oh, I tried to parry. Clearly didn't work. Gotta try again. If I can get the parry down early in the game, it be a lot better. So, I remember being ganked here and dying by archers. Oh shit, too soon. Might have been too soon. Oh. Right. Let's sit at the bonfire. I think. Can you level up from the bonfires in this game? Or do you have to go back to the lady? You have to go back to the lady. But you can teleport from every single bonfire in the game. So it's not as bad. Yes. Holy shit. Well, this is not working. Holy crap. Is that even a parry? Are we sure about that? What else would it be? God damn. God damn. Oh, come on now. Holy crap. Oh, it is. But it's really, really, really hard to pull off. God. Oh, double. Double action, double fun. Okay, let's kill one at least. God, I. They fall back for some reason. Instead of uh, giving me the repulse attack. Is it normal? Is it just these guys being dicks? being difficult I mean it's the first damn enemy in the game I feel like it shouldn't be that difficult to parry oh my god holy shit yeah I know maybe um, the scimitar is not the best thing to use for parry is this a parrying shield this is a parry shield Wanna try a parry shield instead? Let's see if it's a bit better. Maybe it has um, a bigger window. Holy shit. Well, that seemed a lot better immediately. So maybe it's just a scimitar that's not made. Pairing. Yeah, I, I believe so. I do believe that's the case. Oh, maybe though. It's weird, they don't really... They don't really um, get countered. They just fall back. It's really weird. Oh, too soon. Mm. 
this is gonna tempt me to use a shield for something other than parry. Ow, bitch! Yeah, I remember you, and yet you still managed to get me. Well, I might be dead already. Woo! 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 <laughs> <laughs> I have no HP. Save me. <laughs> Save me, vampire. Oh my god. I forgot how ruthless this game is from the very beginning. <laughs> it doesn't really hold back. <coughs> Damn. All right. Let's go in hard. Let's be aggressive. So arrows work differently in this one as well. In, uh, in the other Dark Souls, they kinda tend to follow you around. In this one, however, they kinda go straight in the di- They kinda predict your movement direction. And they try to get you like that. So, if you zigzag, sometimes, see, it went completely the other way. That's a bit more realistic indeed. <laughs> Instead of homing arrows, yes, feels a lot more realistic. Yo! Yo! The hell did you came from? I thought I cleared up up there. Where was that guy? Oh, I remember this place. It was a mess. We can climb faster, though. Yeah, a lot of dead bodies, a lot of real dead undead. still alive and there was a point where everybody just gets up at once and that's when things get a little troublesome for me also I think I'm gonna try to kill the hide and knight and there was an archer over there somewhere up top here Oh, shame, you cannot ragdoll them. That is a big shame. What's the archer? Zero out of ten. Wow, executed from behind. Nice. Okay, yep, yeah, that's the dude I was talking about. Now, there was a way up, and I remember a lot of dudes around here. Also, I remember making this jump is insanely hard and kills you very quickly. Dude, you son of a bitch. This guy just kicked me in my beautiful, beautiful face. How can you kick a guy like this? I think I'm gonna have to use that.
Also, I remember some asshole jumping down from behind me, maybe? Could it be? I don't know, I thought this place was trouble. So that's the guy throwing the bombs, right? You son of a... Get down there. Oh god. So awkward jumping. Oh, that's true, because everything kind of changed in... Um, well, not everything, but some enemy position changed in Scholar of the First Sin. That's right. <gasps> oh my god, I thought it would slide down. No, it just let go of the staircase, of the, the ladder. Holy crap. Uh, <laughs> right, we need to be careful. Yikes. Didn't I just kill most of them? No, they all... There we go. So imagine doing that when you haven't killed the rest. Yeah, that's fun. Said no one ever. And yes, the Hidden Knight was the one sitting next to the Hidden Tower. But I think in the original game, he was actually sitting here. I know because I have the original on PlayStation 3, I think. And that was the time where I actually started buying Doxels on PC instead. Was something here? Yeah, that guy. That's it. I mean, it can't go up from here. So, hello. Yeah, no right. You try to cheat there. There they are. Now I think it's empty. Yes. Kinda. Um, my scimitar is almost broken. Already. How can you call me nerd if I don't play World of Warcraft? I mean, I am still streaming a PC game, so I guess you can call me nerd anyway. <laughs> How are you doing, Yona? How is today treating you so far? I think I need to switch weapon. What do we have? I can use an axe. Which sucks by the way, but... You sleep, you're gonna take a huge nap. Oof. Also, your network card is wonky, so your internet is spotty. Oh, that's a shame. Maze. True. The absolute strongest item in the game. Or so they say. You can't this one, you can barely play Twitch. Oh, that's a shame. 
So, as you, I remember that guy shooting down the fire thingies. And the archer, oh yeah. You think they're regular mace? This is a regular mace. Oh no, it's a morning saw, never mind. Right. So, here's what happened to me, right? Yesterday, uh, yesterday night I didn't stream, I went out with my friend. And I came home about at about midnight, I'd say. No, it was later than that. It was probably well, it doesn't matter. The thing is, I came home and my ceiling fan was off, which is weird because I always leave it on to just keep the room cool, right? So I turn it on again, and it's it's making this really annoying grinding noise. Oh boy! Oh my God! What did I do? Magic! And so I had to leave it off for the night, meaning I didn't really sleep that well or that much, because it was a bit hot still. Um, somebody, oh that guy, motherfucker, I can't do anything about that. So I, ow, I've been late today on the stream because I called my father and. He helped me. Uh, let, let's be honest, I am a nerd, as you always say, so I don't really do well with practical things. Not, not, not that kind of practical thing. Not electricity and such likes. Um, so, he helped me unmount the fan. We turned off the light on the apartment. We. Uh, there were a lot of screws involved and electrical cables. <laughs> no, I can't conduct electricity. I would say that's a fair assessment. And uh, yeah, we tried to see what was wrong with it, but we. I have a feeling that it's probably the black box, the one that you cannot open with the core of the ceiling fan with a motor inside probably. I don't know what's in there. But it might be broken, so... We'll try to fix it. It's still not attached. We're gonna continue tomorrow. And uh, yes, I had an encounter with a giant spider, which makes everything else seem not so bad, I guess. Traveling merchant raises item discovery. Yeah, I remember this. I think I bought it. Blacksmith shop key, that's the one. I also need to. What did you say? I know your sadness. Kill his other friends. I'm possible your heart is broken and you feel used. Ah. Uh, too. too. too much. Drama queen. There you go, I said it. <laughs> There's no drama there. Uh, do we want heal? I feel like in this game it might be... It might be useful. Feral Slockstone are very useful. 
branch of your, of course it's very useful, but this is like 16k plus that and this. Yikes. I want. You know, if it was real sadness, then maybe. But since it's not, I don't feel bad at all, you know? Wait, can I not regen my weapons? Stop talking to Hexer like I'm not here. Oh, is this the Pharaoh? It's locked. I can hear Crystal Lizard on the other side. Oh well, I'm sure I'll deal with it. Somehow. <laughs> said that. Uh, yeah, there's that dude, but there's also that dude. And this, yeah, he doesn't seem to be. Ooh, I dodged an attack. Amazing. Bye. I think he's dead. But it, I didn't do anything to my biggest fan, okay? Ow! Holy cow, that was quick! Oh my god, they wrecked me. Quickly climb the ladder and regen some HP. I was too much of a nerd for my ceiling fan. I mean, I did play a lot of work recently. You know, what happens if I do this? Yeah, much, much better. What the hell was that turn? Oh my god, look how much damage it did. Fudge. It's locked. Of course it is. I am a, I'm a disaster and I am about to face a very strong early game boss. It's locked again. Everything is locked in this place. Oh yeah, no, it's true, Yona. I am. Oh, and Turtle Boy over here is also a bit of a pain in the bubble. I think the pursuer was here too? Am I am I wrong? Is he not here? Nap time Nerd and taxi, okay Yona, have a good one. God damn it. You can 
die ro Whoa. Ow! Arrow. <laughs> that stupid guy over there. Wait, is he supposed to be there? Oh, well, we're gonna find out if the pursuer is. Fuck, I hear. Oh my god. Yep! He's right there, alright. That was so bullshit. Hello? Pursuer? Yeah, no, this is not a pursuer at all! <gasps> what are these people? Oh boy. Let me get my gem! Shit. I don't think he's here. A torch. Single torch. It was flying around, yeah. But, oh my god. But he... Didn't jump down. I don't think it's because I ran off the platform. I think it maybe it's just not here. Jesus. Stop attacking me. Okay. Ooh boy. Are you kidding me? Now I know there's another one over there. Alright, this is probably... Going alright. Yes, Pete, isn't it? Now, I remember being ganked really hard here as well. This asshole, I know you. I know you're not to no good. Hello there. Traveling all alone in these treacherous times. Yeah, right. Well, I hope you have a very good reason. Oh, hogwash. Who am I to judge? <laughs> what was his name, name Pete? Pate. 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 Well, close enough. I journey hither and thither on a sort of treasure hunt, you might call it. Be careful out there. There's talk of unsavory bandits who prey upon travelers like yourself. Oof. So, <coughs> wow. This is something. I, uh, I finished the little uh, bottle of brandy I had. It was very little. It was a 0 0.1 liter bottle. You know, like those, um, Sample bottles you get in hotel rooms and stuff like that. And uh, <clears throat> I filled it with a liquor that they do in Croatia that my parents brought back from vacation. Which is... I think it's made from pears. It's very sweet, I really really like it. And I definitely just filled my... We'll bother with it. It's not brandy, no, it's um 
It's kind of a thick liquor. It's very dense, it's very sweet. Now, this is exactly what I remember. What the hell? Where were you aiming? There we go. Oh, what? 250 damage! Oh, you know what? How did I do so much damage to that guy? That was insane. Only it's a bit of a problem now. Can I kick? That is definitely not kicking. That's up. That's down. Oh. Oh, you guys are trying. Oh. We get me, assholes. What are you guys doing? What am I doing? <laughs> That's a real question. <laughs> don't exactly know how to deal with this, you know? <laughs> you know what, I'm gonna do the smart thing. I don't know if it's smart, but let's remove it. At least one is dead. And two is dead. So the zombie... The third one left somewhere. I think I saw it inside. There may be more than three. Screw you guys. Oh yes, you be cautious if you go any farther. There's treasure in there for certain, but the entrance locks from behind. Yeah. I saw the same design earlier. Because you and lock the same it. Contraption, I'm sure. I was with this warrior, you see, and he insisted that he go inside first. Mm-hmm. The rather brusque fellow tried to swipe the loot for himself. It trapped him inside. Yes. I it. still have the gent's ring. I do hope he wasn't harmed. Oh. I mean, you can give me the ring. I'll leave this one to you. Thank you. I'm worried about what might be inside. I'll leave this oh, one. Oh, he's not giving me the ring. I might ki I could kill him. Do I have any rings? Increase HP slightly. Well, better than nothing, right? Blue wooden shield. Radiant life gem. There's a side quest later we paid. Oh, okay. Great of soul arrow. Already good magic. Uh, where the hell am I swinging? <laughs> I like. <laughs> I really like when they die. They do this little awkward jump. Now, I remember this being very dodgy, like, filled with explosive barrels dodgy. And a dude up there bombing me, yep. It's exactly as I remember it. Is this the one where you can get oiled and then you take more damage from, from the fire? Oh, 
Oh yeah, I remember, don't worry, actually. Yo, 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 full combo, they didn't die. Well, he died now, but oh, his friend is just, oh. Oh. There we go. Who's not gonna... Yeah, the oil was a thing, wasn't it? Yeah, I remember that. Large soul lost and dead, and this is one of the giants. Cool. Now this was leading upstairs. That was a jump. Ah, yes. But I think I can reach the guy. Yeah, those guys with the bombs from over here. It's really dark in here, by the way. Really, really dark. So I could light a torch over here. I think, by the way, you can turn off the torch and it's not gonna consume the entire torch, it's gonna keep the time that you burned it. I don't know why I would want to do that, but... Oh, there's another one over there, shoot. Oh! Good stuff. Okay, not so good stuff. I'm dead. I'm clearly dead. Like my dance around the chest? Ah, that was something. Oh shit! Mail breaker and infantry helmet. I think the mail breaker is a type of um. of rapier. So we should probably get used to it. It's got these very quick attacks that don't consume a lot of stamina. Lots of critical pierces through armor, I believe. Now, this was bullshit. Yeah, that was really bullshit. Yeah, look at that. You can just keep swinging and it has a lot of uh, stagger. It is very stabby stabby, yes. But look at this, we, uh, we kind of fixed this place. Okay, what was it over here? Oh! Oh, we're here already? Okay. We need to open the, um, the shortcut, I guess. This is the boss room, though. We need a key first. I don't know what I'm doing. But they glitch very awkwardly when they do that. So. Bam. Done. What was the heavy attack? Oh, just a stronger stab. Hello there, Mr. Ickes. Uh, yeah, right. Pr 
probably filled with awful people killing you all the time. <gasps> oh, I forgot about you. I don't think you were there in the first Dark Souls. I thought he was dead. He was not. I thought I had it. I didn't. I really, really did. Oh my lord. Is that what I think it is? I'm a ninja turtle. I'm a really overweight ninja turtle, I guess. <laughs> so why do a lot of people say Dark Souls 2 isn't a good Dark Souls game? Honestly, I don't know. I like Dark Souls 2. We were talking about it earlier with um, Hexe. And we both kind of like it. It is a little... They, they changed some things? Like adding different stats, they say some of the bosses are not very... You're right. You're right. Some of the bosses are a bit weird. Um, honestly, I just think people want to complain different doesn't mean bad absolute like the way dodging works the way your armor work the way you the corpses are jiggling. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly. It's not the return of Dark Souls 1. It's, it's a proper sequel, and they did change a few systems. Some people didn't like it. That happens. I do like it. I do like this game a lot. For me, it definitely has some of the hardest boss in the entire Dark Souls series. And when we're talking about bosses like the Fume Knight, I think it's a good hard, not a cheap hard. If that makes any sense. Wait, this was oh that goes down to the to the giant. That's right. So I didn't find a key, I didn't find anything. I think I have to go back. You gotta go back, Marty. Yeah, that's right. Might have been in uh, that area downstairs. We'll see. We'll see right now. I do remember a Faro's door being down here. Yes, and the place being very, very dark. There's the door. Second wall too? Was there a second doll around here? Second doll? A second wall? <laughs> I can hear whispering. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. <laughs> Wait, is this a game where you also have to click the walls?
Was this a mimic? No, but it has a trap. Ah, ah, God, that was horrible. That was a titanite shard. So you had to, like, click to open the secret walls, right? Sometimes, not all of them, but some of them. <laughs> Show my back. I mean, honestly, with this kind of guy, I feel like the front is its best. He, he, he his best side. So, um. We don't want to ruin that beautiful face. Okay, just tough here. Yeah. yeah, I don't know what to do here. I think it's. I don't know if there's, there's, there's a secret wall over here. And there definitely isn't a. Hey, what was I about to say? I don't know, something else. <laughs> there isn't something else. Though. The key, yes, that's what I was thinking. There's no key there. Now, I feel like I should be able to somehow maneuver myself up there. Maybe just by doing this, yeah? Yeah, that works. <laughs> Way, way simpler than I made it out to be. God, I have to switch weapon to break stuff to not ruin my mail breaker. How stupid is that? We will try to get um, the... what's it called? The Brass Knuckle Ring plus 2 as soon as possible. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Why do I have a flashback about this? I think I kinda understand why I was having issues with this. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 I see, I see, I see, I see. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. I shouldn't be here. I understand. No, no, no. I see your point. You don't, you don't you don't have to remark it with your swords and your pointy sticks. It's fine. I understand. I I'm not welcome. Yeah, okay. You you can do that or you can just you know, go back. Turn around, pretend I wasn't here. Or you can go through the door and you know, help me stabbing you. There you go. My character looks like a cross between the doll in Saw movies and Punch from Punch and Judy. I don't know what Punch and Judy is, but yes, I, I, I do see the resemblance with the Saw doll, especially when I have the tattoos. It's weirdly tattooed. <laughs> Man, I think I got rid of that pretty um, pretty easily. I remember dying there, honestly. Back when I was a Dark Souls noob. Yeah. Yeah, thank you, Paid. Thank you very much. I think I'm safe here, right? I 
let's see. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> well, it was definitely a lot closer when... Um, when I had a red skin in one of the many iterations of this character. Oh my lord. Bodies are dropping. Let the bodies hit the floor. All right, you asshole. Ah, oh, broke my legs. Don't worry. Too. Well, I see you managed to escape. Yeah. I hope that brave warrior didn't come a cropper either. Be careful out there. There's talk of unsavory bandits who prey upon travelers like yourself. Mm-hmm. Oh. But you should take this. It allows undead to call out for help to one another across the fissures between worlds. With luck. I think this guy, by the way, is he the patches of this game? It's called Pate. Patches paid. I do see a resemblance. He's got a, he's got a similar armor set, and he's got a spear as well. Well, I s be careful now. I think he might have been supposed to be patches. Maybe. So hang on a second. I don't. I don't have the key. I don't have the key. How the hell do I get the key? Oh, by the way, guys, you should remind me when it's time to end the stream because I don't have a, a watch. I don't have a clock. I don't know. Oh, there's another area. Oh, let's go back up. I need to repair. I need to spend some of my souls as well. No, the blacksmith. Sure, we'll remind you. <laughs> no, the blacksmith key is here, and it's about. I I already got it. Uh, I could buy the Pharaoh's lock stone. Find me twelve k for the branch of your. Oh, I bought. Didn't I buy the helmet and I did not equip it? Ah, yes. Yes. See, with a monocle is now all better. Uh, as silly as that looks, it actually increases my item find. So, I guess, uh, it's allowed to keep it on for now. Oh my god, you're here. Hi. Is that a shard you found? Is it? Here, let me see it. So that I may help you. To see light, however... The thing with the mimic chest helmet, the uh, what's it called, the sign of avarice, something like that, is that you continuously lose life. It's not cool. It's really not cool. So what do I need here? Uh, I think we need to. That's a creep load. That is stamina. Oh. Oh my. That's a lot more life. Man, I do want to do this.
increases all the resistances, poison, bleeding, petrified, curse, agility is the, um, the, the, the iframes, and the poison's not bad, I guess, as well. Sure, you know what? Whatever. All right, dude. Got it. I got it open. Ah, oh, yes. Very good. Yes. Very good now indeed. I can get to work. Yes, I need your work, actually. But first, let me set up. Come again later. Mm-hmm. Ah, yes. Very good. Uh, does that mean I have to teleport back in now? I think it is. Well, can I teleport from this place to this place? It's a bit weird, but maybe it reloads the area. Yeah, hey, I think it worked. Yo, hey! You, stand back. This is dangerous work. I know. The name's Lenigrast. Mm -hmm. Just a simple blacksmith. And you are... Uh, uh, another useless traveler. <laughs> Beautiful man. A man ought to labor with his feet planted firmly in the earth. Mm -hmm. Not roam around like you flirtatious vagabonds. Well... Oh, what does it matter? Go on, show me what you've got. Your equipment. Let me have a look. But do it quick. Okay, I got a very rusty blade. Drat. <laughs> You're worse than my reckless daughter. Don't spend your whole life in transit, you hear? I remember your daughter. You'll need souls to repair and improve equipment. I know only of... Don't waste your soul. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so this guy has a sword I need, right? There we go. Yeah, the rapier, which is 1,000 only. I guess that's not bad. Oh, don't waste my time. Who doesn't remember his life? <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. Although, if you have to point it out, then yes, <laughs> I do remember. <laughs> Alright, so this is gonna go here in place. Oh. Ah, look at that, beautiful. It's got the same attack pattern, only it's even longer than the other. You would. And uh, reinforce. So how does reinforce work in this game? How do I have to? What do I have to do to get it to something different? Uh, let me look it up really quick. Uh, upgrades, I think. How does one upgrade equipment? Yes, that's exactly what I want to know. So, let's say I want this to become lightning. Which I think is what I'm going for here. Or dark. One of the two. Uh, how does that work? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll do that. Actually, it's kinda late. So, I will do that very soon. Uh, I can't find how to upgrade my stuff. Do I need to... 
Can I do a normal upgrade or do I have to... Steady Hand Macduff is the other blacksmith, I remember him. But I don't remember how to upgrade it. Does it go from blank to lightning or do I have to upgrade it normally until, I don't know, plus 5 maybe? Yeah, something like that. Because in Dark Souls 1 you definitely needed to get it to plus 5 or plus 10. To make it lightning, for example. <laughs> Are you testing the rating? Infusion Pass. There we go. There's a tab for this. Oh, no. It's stupid. Weapon enchantment as well as items. Build pirates and pirates as well as weapon. Blah, blah, blah. I don't... I can't find it. Let's take this out the base magic work for infusions. Then the end. This weapon base damage will drop to 70% so magic plus 10. I think you know... I think you kinda have to do it with a blank weapon. The thing is, um, it doesn't really matter because I can just buy another rapier and it's only 1000 so... It's fine. Up one tuition. <laughs> Who needs that anyway? Bam. Okay, it's plus one. Is it? Yes, it is. Okay, perfect. I'll be around if you make it back. Look, already it's 126 plus 36. You found the one you like <laughs> because <laughs> the perfect combination. All right, let's see if we can get the giant down and call it a day. Ah, you can slide, of course you can. Oh, I remember that place up there. Holy crap. With the giant salamanders. Not a fan. Not a fan at all. Wasn't there a door? Wow, that was a lot of damage, wasn't it? There was a door here, but it was locked. Oh, maybe the key! I got the key! I got the key from the, di the giant. Maybe. There we go, first official boss of Dark Souls 2. The giants to be really odd creatures in Dark Souls. I don't know, there's something about that hole in their face that makes me really curious. It doesn't feel natural, it feels like it's a curse or something. I want more giant lore. I know they have been in a war about something. Oh, triple stomp. Ooh, I did that hitbox was so much more hit.
Wow. <laughs> All right. All right, last giant. You try. Try your best. And we got the soldier key. Plus 10k souls. That's not bad, right? I think that's actually really, really good. We can almost farm a couple of guys and afford to... What the fuck is that? <gasps> what are you doing here? Where... How and where and when? Oh boy! I mean... He seems to be very stuck. Because he's not supposed to be there. Could that be the reason? <gasps> Don't come in here. Okay. Whew. Why though? I don't understand. It's locked. What do you mean it's locked? Wait, is this the same? No, it's not. Am I in a different place? No, I'm not. Oh, there's just two different elevators. Okay. Good stuff. I remember now. Sorry. <laughs> Sometimes I am a little forgetful. Now, you don't need to be here. Oh, this weapon is... I never used this weapon before, but I can tell already it's amazing, isn't it? The stagger is insane! Ah, yes, I remember this. Wait, I think I pursue. Oh no, there was that guy. You can stay there. I'm gonna just pick up this uh, uh, this grand lance and uh, this thing. I guess is it a trap? Is it not? Is it a mimic? Is it gonna eat me? No. Fine. That is the door that opens with the king's ring, right? Also, this guy was something else forty four damage great nothing let's try with a rapier a lot more damage wow Plus the stagger. Oh, <gasps> what was that bullshit hitbox? He's cornered. I don't think that matters. At all. Ooh. <laughs> it was going for a combo. I actually didn't really see it. Oh. oh, come on. There we go. Twelve thousand. That is exactly what I need 
to buy the fragrant branch of your Ain't that cool? Okay, guys, we're gonna call late after I buy that thing. If the witch is still here, I think the witch moves at some point, so we might want to buy it while we can. There we go. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I think we're gonna play Dark Souls 2 for a while now, although keep in mind that for next week we're gonna interrupt a couple of times a week with um, World of Warcraft raiding. I know, incredibly boring for most of you, but um, I just wanna try, I just wanna try it out, see how it is with my guild, it might be good, it might be really bad. Oh my god, it's really dark in here. Oh my god, it's really dark in here. Gotta do my job. It's not really a job, but... <laughs> it's definitely something that I wanted to do for a while. There's a mimic? Nah. Too early for a mimic. There's another door right there, though, isn't it? It's there. Hello? Oh, shit. oh, okay. Oh. Thank goodness I turned. Definitely was about to die there. Trap? No. Soapstone, Radiant Life Gem, and then I just need to land this right. I got this. I got this. There we go. Done. Alright, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good day, have a good night, and uh, I will see you all tomorrow. Okay, guys. All right, I'm gonna leave you with Max Frey. It's four, right? Yes. So let's see if we can do it. Let me open my thing over here. It's actually a a very long process if you don't have a double monitor. Because I have to open my browser, go into Twitch, type in the thing, get in my own channel. And then slash raid max fray four. There we go, guys. Have a good one. Goodbye.